Hi guys, I'm Isaac from ePianos and today we are doing a showroom live where I show you three instruments that we've got in the showroom on sale and I'm going to see what you think. Check out the ePianos website for all the latest offers and deals on digital pianos and keyboards and have a look at our huge selection of pre-owned instruments as well. So the first one I want to show you is this one right here, it's the Yamaha CLP 625 Clavanova. It's the first one in the range and for the price you get a lot, it's a really great quality piano. Um, I'll play you the piano sound now. As you turn it on, it will sound like this. Now that sound you're hearing is the CFX Grand, which is a £100,000 concert grand piano right here on this. And the touch of the keys, I have to say, is really impressive. It's got something called synthetic ivory key tops. So they are weighted just like a real grand piano. Um, which forces you to play a little bit harder, but that's a good thing because as I say, it's like a real acoustic grand to play. Um, and this model in particular has something called escapement mechanism, which is a little bit, I'll show you if I turn it down, a little bit of resistance on the keys. I don't know if you can see that, but when I play the keys just lightly, as you get halfway down, there's a slight bit of resistance just halfway, and that is mimicking what a real grand piano does, and just gives that little bit more realistic sensation when you're playing. Um, back to the piano sound, as I say, you've got the CFX grand when you turn it on. Which is faultless, really, really nice sound. But then you have actually got 10 voices built into this, so you have got a couple of um, variations on the piano. The second one, is the Bosendorfer, which is a very different, softer grand piano sound. Very, very different. I'll turn it up a bit. Really nice for sort of classical, if you're composing TV music, it might be nice to get some sort of soft piano sound like this. But then you've got things like electric pianos that you can scroll through to. If you're doing jazz, perfect for that sort of thing. Um, you can even put two sounds together, like a, an orchestra. So you could have a piano on the, on, the, on the main instrument and then you can have a layer of strings, which is quite nice, like this. Can you hear the strings? Sounds awesome. Um, and that's it, it's very simple. It is made for um, those of you that just want to focus on playing piano, you're not fussed about having lots of bells and whistles, styles and rhythms and things. This is very simple to use. Looks great, sounds great, and it's not really going to break the bank account as well, um, And because it, it's really affordable, but you get a good quality instrument at the same time. Um, another thing I will just add, you can record on it too, so if you're learning a piece you can record a right and left hand, just another little tool that will help you learn. So the next piano I want to show you is our pre-owned CVP609 in a lovely polished mahogany colour. Um, if you want to follow me over here I can show you, if you follow me over here, it's this lovely looking one. Um, as I say it's the polished mahogany finish, which they don't make anymore funnily enough, but I think it looks really really slick, um, makes it a bit more limited edition. Um, now when you open it up and you turn it on, you are met with the Concert Grand and this big colour screen which is touch screen, just like a iPad or a tablet. Press the button, gives you menus and things, I will get to that in a second. But first of all, if not the most important thing, what does it sound like? I will play it. Absolutely fantastic sound on this one, um, and the nice thing about this is, as it is the it was top of the range back when it was new, 
Um, it's currently the 700 series is the newest one, so the 600 is the predecessing range and the 09 is the top of that range. Um, the nice thing about it is it's got wooden keys, so unlike the, the CLP6, uh, 625 that I was playing, this one has wooden keys, as you can see here, which gives you a little bit more realism, a bit more weight, really grippy with the synthetic ivory key tops, um, and the wood, I think, makes all the difference as a piano player. Not to mention all this stuff that you've got going on here, which is I know looks a bit daunting with all the buttons, but it's really easy to use, and I'll show you how to do it now. Um, changing the voice, press the button there on the on the screen, and you're met with the menu. Now you've got more than one piano sound, as you can see: grand piano, rock piano, cocktail, all these pages, upright piano. The '70s ballad piano is really nice for the John Lennon stuff, especially Imagine. Really beautiful sound, and there's so much in there. You can go through, there's a guitar section with all these guitars, not only acoustic but electric. I really like just the, the basic concert grand. You can hear the fret noises. Sounds so realistic. Moving on, you've got strings as well. My, one of my favourites is the, the Celtic violin, and I'm sure you'll recognise what I play here. Sounds so realistic. All of the instruments in here sound really realistic and it is just mind blowing really, it's amazing. The brass as well, you go to a jazz trumpet. One of my favourite things about playing the trumpets is the slide. So if you play an octave, it will slide up. Fantastic. All of the sounds in there are really, really realistic. And as I say, there's so much built in, hundreds of voices. Um, even you can put two sounds together, like I did on the 625. If I go back to the nice piano sound we were on and go back to the main page, you've got this button here that says layer. Now, when I press layer, it does just that. It gives me another layer of an instrument. And it, the, by default, it gives you the strings. But I can go through, um, I've got classical strings here. I'll do that. It's really great. Now that's just one section of the Heat CVP. You've actually got lots of styles built in, so rhythms, drum beats. Um, similarly to the voice section, when you press the style you're met with this menu screen where you can scroll through pages and pages of different styles of, of, of beats, of rhythms. You can go to pop, country and blues, standards and jazz. You pick a jazz one and you can play a chord in the left hand here. Gives you a nice backing. And you can play... Now the nice thing about the CVP is the cleverness of it really, I've picked a jazz style um, and with every style the instrument, the piano will give you suggested voices and all I need to do is press this button over here called OTS link, that is the one touch setting area which makes everything much easier so I turn that on and now when I play I can change the voice at the click of a button. Again. And 
it will even end it for you. Fantastic. And it's so easy. All you do is press that button and it does a lot of the work for you. All you need to do is press the buttons, gives you all these different um, voices that suit the style you pick. So every style will give you a completely set of new voices when you've got the one such setting on. For example, I can go to a, a country and blues style. I think I put one in the favourites. Yeah, 6 8 rock, for example. I'll pick that one. By default, on A, on the variation A, I've got a, an organ up here, which is a really bluesy sounding organ and all I need to do is play a chord like I did before. I'll put a little introduction on this time as well just so you can hear the quality. And now I can play. the organs is if I press this pedal, the left pedal, while I'm playing, it will add the Leslie effect. So if I hear this and press, can you hear it get quicker, slower, quicker, really nice touch. And I can move on. Electric guitar. And again, moving on. Pop grand. Last one. Electric guitar. It will end it for you. It is awesome, absolutely awesome. You can spend, and I do, hours playing it in the showroom. Um, but I know for some people, you'll look at this and you'll go, there's loads of buttons, what am I going to do with all of those? Don't worry if you're not the one in the family that likes playing with all the styles and the rhythms. There is a button on here just for you, and it's called Piano Room. All you need to do is press that button, and you are met with this beautiful looking grand piano and that's all you do. You just have a grand piano and you play piano. No special effects, anything like that. It is as simple as that. It's there for you to play the piano, really rich. Now if you wanted to, you could be a bit clever and if I show you on the screen, you could open the piano lid if you wanted to, which gives a bit of a uh, a brighter sound. You can even change where you are. So if I wanted to play a piano in a cathedral, which would give a very different atmosphere, you just do that on the screen. You can hear the echo. Sounds like you're in a very big room. Shut the lid again. I could even change the piano itself if I wanted a, an upright piano. And I could change that to be in a, a living room, for example, which gives a very different feel. So if you're a piano player traditionally, um, and you're, you're, the, you're the one in the family that just wants to play piano, but some others like to play on the, the styles, that button is really, really useful and just a nice tool to have. It's so cool, so visual. You can change where you are. It gives you nice presets um, and it is just really easy to use. Now, all of this can be saved instantly using this registration memory section. So any uh, settings that you want to keep, all you need to do is press a couple of buttons and it will save. And now the Great thing about the 600 series, and especially the 609, is this little port over here, the USB port. 
That means that anything that you want to keep, put onto your laptop, put into music software, into Logic, upload to YouTube and all that sort of thing, you can export it to a USB, plug it in, easy peasy, doesn't take too long at all. Or vice versa, if you've got songs that you want to play along with on iTunes and you want to put them on a USB, do so, plug it in and it will play through the speakers and you can play along with it. Um, now I should move on, I could play this all day here in the showroom, so let's go on to the next one which is the CLP295, another pre-owned of ours, um, and it is a grand piano and it looks beautiful, follow me. So this is it, the 295, as you can see it is the grand piano look, it is gorgeous, if I just shut the lid a second and move out the way. You've got the lid that opens, you've got some speakers at the back here, so it kind of mimics the, the big sound of a grand piano. Um, it's one of the older Clavinovas, it, it's, it's from the 200 series, but it was top of the range of its time, which means, like the 609, you've got wooden keys, which is really, really important, like I say. Um, 38 voices, so it's very simple to use, not too much um, built in. It focuses really, like the Clavinova um, 625 that I was playing, on being a really good quality piano. I'll play the piano sound for you now. This makes all the difference. You really do feel like you're playing on a concert grand piano. Um, the sound is, is, is beautiful. That And you've got lots of voices built in, so it's not just that piano sound, you've got another grand piano sound. A bit brighter, maybe for sort of more jazz stuff, pop. electric pianos again for all the sort of Stevie Wonder stuff. Again you can put two sounds together like the um, like both of them like both the clavinovas that I showed you. Piano and strings, classic one to go for. But that's it, it's very simple, it is a piece of furniture, definitely, it looks fantastic, it sounds great, it's not going to break the bank account for what it is, for a grand piano nowadays, a real grand piano, you're going to be spending thousands and thousands, um, but this gives you the best of both worlds, you won't have to tune it because it's electric, so you get this really top quality sound all the time, you don't have to worry about um, tuning it every sort of three to four months, however much you use it, um, you can shut the lid as well if you wanted to, um, but it's great, wooden keys, brilliant sound, um, and that's it. If you want to have a read about all of these that I've shown you, check out the website, epianos.co.uk. Lots more information on there. Have a look at some of our other videos as well, and if you've got any questions, drop us an email. Speak to you soon. Thanks. Bye-bye.